if the Sultans of Ping's name was stupid, this band's name was clever. They were called Theatrix. Theatrix, get it? They're theatrical. Appearing in the 1980s, Theatrix successfully managed to combine rock and cabaret in much the same way as the trailblazing Sunny Knowles. Here they are in a groovy video shot for Anything Goes in 1981. The Atrics, they were definitely one of my favorite bands. I think it was great to say that an Irish band were one of your favorite bands. And actually, to prove it, I have here, you know? That's the Atrix. Treasure on the Wasteland, original 7-inch with the amazing lyrics, oh wee 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 And in case you don't know, there they are, oh wee oh wee oh wee In case you forget, oh wee oh wee oh wee And there's a picture of them. I was thrilled to see uh, the Atrix video because it just seems so incredibly natural. John Barman's performance is amazing. It's in no way phony or forced or anything else, it's just as he was. And there's the, the Moon is Puce, another brilliant song, with Wendy's in Amsterdam in the back. Yes, thanks, Kevin. Why do the words stalker and possibly armed suddenly spring to mind? I actually saw them at the last ever gig. I thought it was a pity. Another band that I felt. I'd love to have seen them get some recognition. A very original band, the Atlas, you know. And for me, they still stand up today. He, he's a very interesting front man as well. Looks like he's sort of a, a demented farmhand from some Hammer Horror House movie. There was one summer, and I think, I'm not sure if it was 1989 or 1990,